Hey everybody, how's it going? Welcome to my second thoughts on Iron Man 3. I just saw a second trailer for the film, I gotta say. It is getting really, really hard to keep my expectations to a minimum, because this is just, just fucking awesome. Alright, um... Now, the trailer begins with Tony Stark, um, you know, narrating, just like in the first uh, trailer, on how he wants to protect the people he cares about and how he just can't sleep. Uh, we see glimpses of the uh, Iron Legion in the middle of the trailer, but then we see the whole Iron Legion in the end of the trailer, and uh, we see more of Mandarin, and I'm really hoping that the scenes in the trailer are not you know, his best scenes in the movie, like, I hope he has a lot of great scenes in the movie, um, I'm also hoping that he doesn't just show up in his own armor, because in the comic, uh, tie-in, they're saying that apparently he might get his own armor, which I really don't want, like, come on, can we be a little bit more, you know, originally here, I mean, almost every single, um, Iron Man villain in the movies has, you know, end up wearing their own armor and getting their ass kicked. Come on, let's do something else here. Um, like, do something with the rings. Like, hell, I'll even take up the frickin' rings or, like, keys or something to a super weapon. Um, maybe from space? Because they're hinting that, you know, the Guardians of the Galaxy will be meeting with Tony in the end of the film. Um, it does work because he also has a, the frickin' space armor. Um... But yeah, like, I'm really hoping that, you know, Mandarin has done really well in the film. Uh, yeah, he had some great scenes in the, um, in this trailer, but looks can be deceiving people. Um, we see more of Rhodey as Iron Patriot, and yes, he's Iron Patriot, frickin' deal with the people. I know some guys are saying that, oh, he's not Iron Patriot, the, the color tone is different from, uh, the Iron Patriot armor, and also, he's a completely different guy. So what? Like, there's a lot of different changes in here. I mean, frickin' they made uh, Whiplash into uh, the Crimson Dynamo's son. No one was complaining about that. Uh, granted, they made him related to the uh, Crimson Dynamo in the comics after the movies, but whatever. It was before that. Um, but yeah, um, I'm really just hoping that this film is just really good. Um, I'm also really hoping that the Iron Legion is not just build up for nothing. Like, I hope they're, like, in the film. Like, they're a key role in here. Like, um, like, I don't want them to just show up in the first half and then get blown to smithere uh, smithereens along with the other armors that, um, get, um, attacked when, uh, Tony's house, um, gets blown up by Mandarin's helicopters. Um, but yeah, like, that's all I gotta say. I'm really looking forward to this. Uh, what do you guys think of the trailer? Do you think it kicks ass? Uh, do you want to see Mandarin in his own armor? Uh, and uh, that's all I got to say. Bye.